Hi there and welcome. Hi there and welcome to a Dare Guitars. I'm in the wrong shed. My name is Bart and this is episode 8 of my scratch build for Great Guitar Build Off 2022. That little clip was from three weeks ago when my wife and I had our first holiday in three years. And part of that trip, we drove through the Great Ocean Road and then across uh, from Queenscliff on the Sea Road Ferry to Sorrento and spent some time on the Mornington Peninsula. And guess who lives around there along the route? Aaron Adair from Adair Guitars was also taking part in Great Guitar Build Off. This year, he took part last year, and I think he built the year before as well. And we had the pleasure of meeting him, spending some time chatting, checking out the guitars he has made, and even getting a sneak peek of his current build, the Middle Earth guitar, before he released his last video. If you haven't been following his build, the link to his build is in the description below. Go check it out. In my opinion, his will be one of the contenders in the Scratch Build competition this year. So do yourself a favor if you haven't already followed him. Go subscribe to his channel. Watch all the way from episode one. You get the entire story. It's not only an interesting and fantastic looking guitar, it's an epic story. Uh, now, back to my build. In this episode, I pick up where I left off four weeks ago, uh, where I had the neck and the body pretty much ready to be glued, had the fretwork done. The aim was to try and have it complete and have a complete guitar by the middle of this month. Well, we've reached that point. Watch to find out what I've done and just how far I've managed to get to. And at the end, I'll show you the guitar and where I am right now. I'll see you at the end.
for watching that. So you know, if you watch the entire video, that I've got the body and neck glued as one. I've carved the transition from of the heel and spent quite a bit of time sanding. And just yesterday, I put on the finish. So this is where we are now. It feels good. It's the first time I'm using Crimson Guitars Melamine finish and it's beautiful. It was, wasn't difficult to use. Well, the first uh, application, I realized it dries very quickly, so I had to move quickly. But once you put it on, wait a few minutes, buff it, it has a very nice and smooth finish. What I will do though, is let this sit for a week, wet sand it a little, not too much, and then do one final coat on that. And of course, the other thing that I need to do is put in the pickups and the switch, well, the switches and the knob and the hardware. And then it's a setup and we're done. And I hope to have all that done uh, next weekend so that I have a week for the final video. Well, for the demo and the final video, which will include a uh, look back at the entire build process all the way from the beginning. So thank you for staying with me till the end of this video. If you like what you saw, then give me a thumbs up down there. And if you haven't already subscribed and would like to follow, well, the rest of the build, one more video and maybe another one after the end of the competition, then why not click that subscribe button? Meanwhile, take care, stay healthy, and have a good week. I'll see you in the next video.